y'all. Y'all, we're gonna be sitting in a jacket a lot. Cause it be cold. Uh-huh. Cold, cold, baby, cold. Okay, y'all. So I made it back home. The food is sweating. See it's sweat. It's how hot it is. It's the mac and cheese. This don't look like tails, and then what else to get? So I got red beans. I got I got red beans. Let's turn it this way because I know the video is probably different. Red beans and rice, oxtails, and curry vegetables. I hope my thing's still recording. I hope y'all can hear me because somebody calling and I don't feel like answering right now. Because they don't want nothing. But this thing down of the way. But I want to make the story time. Story time. Mook, is it mukbang? Mukbang? Mm. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. I'm going to be some food. <laughs> But I am about to get my gloves because why I keep calling y'all hold on. How? People do not want to call you when you're doing that. Mm. Well hot. Hold on y'all, let me get some gloves. Let me grab some gloves, cause the they oxtails used to be bigger than that. Hey, like, seriously, like, yeah, bigger than that. But um, baby, I love me to eat. I just said I was gonna use the glove. Mm hmm. I'm trying to get the food too. We are all. I gotta, um. I'm going to invest into some own YouTube equipment because this ain't hitting it. Y'all getting half of my head, half of my food, but that's a start. Y'all saw it somewhere, right? I should have got a large side of macaroni and some toothpicks. I don't want to start my story time yet because that phone call just said he about to pull up and we'll come see the kids. And you know, when people see a camera going, they be so extra. I ain't got time for none of that. Come see the kids, go back to business. Mm. But yeah, um, I ain't going to the kitchen because my chair out there and they're here working my nerves. Mm-hmm. It's the curry vegetables for me. I'm telling you. But I always get oxtails when I go there. I'm going to switch the meat up. Mm. That was a piece of bone. I'm going to switch the meat up the next time I order. I think they got seafood too. I tried it on... Um, curry goat the, the meat to me is just like 
too tough. I don't want to just be sitting there chewing majority of the time and get tired of chewing. I'm about to be lit the rest of the day. It's so hot in here. This plate got it hot. I think they got the damn heat on. Mm -mm. I'm not going to turn off. Y'all watch my food. Y'all done cleaning the front room, living room? Man, the kitchen? I hope y'all stay and stay fat in that weather. They, they say it's supposed to be some type of storm in North Carolina. I don't know what time. Girl, go put, put it up. Close my door, Imani. But I do have a story time. Uh, I'm just off the wall right now. But... Let me ask y'all men this. You have a female friend in a friend zone, right? You know she got kids, not just two, maybe four or more. And you know this, and you knew this for years. So why would you get mad? And start acting like a bitch. And start texting some bitch shit. Now that's that's a big turn off. Oh, that's a big turn off for me. Like, nigga, what? Because first of all, it ain't my fault. You ain't got no car to come to me. For two, I'm not pressing the issue because it's about just chilling, drinking, and smoking. Nothing more. That's it. And you knew this for years. So, why act like a bitch all of a sudden on some rah rah shit? That that's type of shit made me not want to fuck with you. Cause like, if you get mad the simplest shit, or oh, I fell asleep because I'm chopping the kids to sleep, and I fell asleep before them, or I fell asleep before two of them, the other two still up. Why would you get mad? In my eyes, you're not a man. Like for real. I just want to hang with people, cause I don't know what they be having going on through their mind. Just because I be chilling with them. I'm right no one. And I get annoyed very quick, like. Especially if I'm not approaching you on that type of level. And for some reason, I don't like it when men approach me. I don't. I gotta approach them. And if they do approach me, they're going to get mad because they're going to feel like they're getting a run around. Well, I told you what it was, how busy I be, and what I'm not looking for. That's the first thing I'm going to let you know during y'all little deep conversations. I ain't looking for nothing. <laughs> Majority times, well... I don't want friends. People don't show me the definition of that. They'll use you. Allow you. And steal from you. Y'all, I'm very disappointed. Because, like, I asked for a large. Y'all give me all this fucking rice and beans and this little bit of ass meat. You know what? They look I'm getting on um, that I'm gonna try that foo foo shit next because <sighs> this is very much ridiculous. But yeah, like I can't stand when dudes do that. That's why I just stated myself, like stated myself. <laughs> Because, like I said, 
If ain't the females using you, lying on you, fucking behind your back on your nigga on your baby daddy, it's these niggas acting like bitches all because you not a yes bitch. And all because we're always busy. Did I turn the AC on or not? I'm not one of those. Mm -hmm. I don't bow down to no nigga. I don't give a damn how much I'm feeling. I don't give a damn how much I'm in love with you. I'm not bowing down to no nigga. No man. Whatever. No nigga because a man would make you feel like you should have to bow down to him for him to cater to you. So I, I was right. No nigga. I prefer a man. But I ain't looking. I got too much going on. Because at the end, I just feel like they come around just for a fuck and a nut. Well, y'all could go on the back page or whatever and order your hoe for $40. Because I ain't it. Especially if you want a quick nut. I don't be, I don't be caring about sex. Oh, my face is dry. Right. Man, I'm getting full. They're like I'm pregnant already. Hold on. Shout. These braids on my back while I'm wearing this dress could get so annoying. I don't know. This camera make me. Oh my gosh. Hold on, y'all. It calling again. I don't know. I got invested to a. Uh... A rain light stand. I ain't want to go in the kitchen because I don't want the kids to see what I got. They got enough food in that refrigerator, and I cooked yesterday, so they gonna eat that. But I was craving for oxtails. Which I am very much disappointed. Y'all, <laughs> I'm getting annoyed just sitting here. I'm, like, I'm just getting annoyed because I have to keep, I'm trying to keep scooting down so I can see me. But yeah, y'all, what that do, I ain't no blocking him. Well, I don't mind having male associates, but it's a certain extent when I feel like you trying to pressure me to do something or you get mad with little shit, especially when it's dealing with my kids, that's a no-no. I don't care if you're a friend or a companion. You're, you're not about to do that. My kids come first before anything. For real. Oh, my so that's why I be alone, Dolo. Hmm. What the hell is that horror? I want that piece in my mouth. Where is it at? I feel a hard piece. Is it a hard piece of cheese? It had to be in. That's wow. Is that why y'all like watching people eat? So y'all can see some crazy stuff happen. Aw, oh, man. I'm over it. Focus. Focus camera. That's what I'm gonna focus. Now it's focus because y'all had me looking like that camera had me looking like I was sick. But yeah. Oh, y'all, I had a video earlier. But I think it was only like a minute or two. <laughs> and I think that's why Facebook, like, not Facebook. Somebody must be on Facebook talking about me because I've been deactivated that. But YouTube was like, oh, they could monetize that one. 
And I know for one, I think it was a one to two minute video. I didn't have no intro. I didn't have no outro. And I didn't have no thumbnail. So I'm thinking it was all of the above. And I just went on and deleted it. But what I had said on there was, because I didn't want to get out of bed. Everybody have days like that. I hate when I get stuck in my teeth. But also, uh, uh, somebody been toothpick. But all I said was, it is okay to not be okay. You don't have to, I got the hiccups now. You do not have to always be strong. Like us, you could be that type of person that's always strong and carrying everybody weight on your back. But when it's like your time to like let go of all that pressure, you cry. Cause I did it last night. I played my Whitney Houston. I have nothing about ten times, <laughs> and I cried my eyes. I started thinking about all like all this, all the shit. That people did wrong to me or what not trying to figure out why because I'm a giving person, I'm a helping person. All y'all do is cross me. What well, they they do. I, I ain't mean to say y'all, but all they did was cross me. And I still wanna come around me like shit ain't happened. No, I cut that off. Like, don't nobody come around me no more. Don't nobody show up to my house unannounced no more. Cause I let them know like there's a boundary. And I'm you know now, like all that shit is dead. You cut off. I'm gonna deal with you. Don't pop up to my house. They don't call my phone or nothing. They don't come ask me for nothing. Cause you gotta put your foot down, show them that you mean what you say. And that's that. Cause you can't always be strong for everybody. You gotta be strong for yourself. But sometimes, like I said, it is okay to not be okay. And I have my days. Shit. I don't be wanting to vent to people. Cause people like take that and try to use it against you, which I don't care, but They'll take it, try to use it against you, try to switch your words up and have people looking at you funny. But the whole time, people want to go do their research because you're talking about that person so much. They're like, oh, well, she really a cool. She really a cool ass female. And one thing they're going to say about me for sure. I'm about my bread. <laughs> I'm a hustle. I don't need nobody for, I don't need nobody for that. Nobody. Mm mm. I'm telling you, it's okay to forgive, but you got to cut them off. I could have did so many people so, so grimy. It don't make no sense. And half the time, they don't think I be knowing that the shit they be doing might not be. I just don't say nothing because it's pointless. I just know how to move after all that. And that. But y'all, I'm about to get off. I'm getting full. I'm going to get this rice up off the floor. And um, I don't know, I'm really getting sleepy, but I want to go to sleep. I'm drinking those so I can stay up because for some odd reason, I don't. My contact. For some odd reason, I don't want to go to sleep. I'm just mad how they give me a little bit of ass meat for large, like. That's wow. What y'all, what y'all, low me? The fuck? For real. I'm gonna try to do this. If I don't eat it, I'm not sure I eat it. But I know I'm gonna go back later and try to eat it. But, um. Mmm. Some curry vegetables. Thank you, Jam Rock. Thank you. But make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell and turn all notifications on. Hit that notification bell down below. And once again, you want to become that next winner for that giveaway, which is on Sunday. Comment below. Matter of fact, be the first one to comment below. Screenshot it. Send it to my DM on Instagram, which is 
HMD underscore Apatima. HMD underscore A-P-E-T-A-M-I-N. If you can't remember, just go down the description box and just click the Instagram logo and it's going to take you to my Instagram. So be the first one to, mm, excuse me, be the first one to comment, screenshot it, send it to my DM. I was doing a little record thing, but I got tired of saying all that word and over. But comment below, screenshot it, and send it to my DM. It's not that hard. Y'all get free stuff. Like, work for it. Teamwork, make the dream work. For real. Here, I'm going to let y'all try this. I'm talking about I'm going to let y'all go look. Curry vegetables. But I'm off. I'm out. I'm about to say I'm off this. Hope y'all enjoyed my vlog slash mukbang, mukbang. Y'all let me know how to pronounce it.